<laughs> Next, I was muted myself. Next time on YouTube. Okay, I mean, this time on YouTube. Uh, I mean, uh, we beat the game. Oh my god, no, I'm nervous. I haven't played in a month. It's been, this has been a month in the making. This is it. Well, I'm gonna take a quick break before it's finally happening. <laughs> it's been a month. <sighs> okay. Ready. Oliver got his treat. This is falling. Is that my squad? Oh, I forgot My uncle. Oh, speech time. Oh my god, me, me and the boys. Bye, Nick. Have a good night. Oh, you're gonna miss the ending. Clive, if you see me dad up there, tell him we were right to leave his legacy with you. <laughs> oh. Tell him. He'll be in the front row. There's no way he'd miss this. So true. Well, behave yourself, Mitt. We'll see. Oh, oh. <laughs> you're so awkward. Hug her back. Yes. Best character moment right there. <laughs> that was so cute. So he's a hugger now. You're in charge now, Gav. Oh, Midgey, she's turning everyone to huggers. And what does Taya have to say about that? Come back before she finds out, eh? She's not even here. It's because we didn't do her quest. So she's just not here. <laughs> Aww. Thank you, Yote. I'm sorry. Your grace, I shall pray for your safe return. That's kind of you, but you should pray he took his medicine. Uh-oh, we're in he trouble. spent all night grinding herbs for his lordship to leave them on his nightstand. Again. <laughs> you needn't fear, Lady Dyer. And thank you. See that your brother comes back in one piece. Or, at most, two. Any more and you can heal him yourself. I'll keep that in mind. She's such a Tomberry. Oh, there's nothing to say that hasn't already been said. <gasps> That's what I was saying! But that never stopped me before. So just you do what needs doing. And don't worry about us. Be we'll more like... Best, uncle. Be more like well. Byron. Hmm. If that is all? Not quite. Oh no. Oh no. Jill. It's time, isn't it? It is. Take care of him. <laughs> you you take care of her too boy where was this oh horrible huh what about the conversation where they're like i'll oh, do anything make sure you get there talk and i was like to die don't forget clive gosh we all choose our own path Oh, not the theme. Yours. I do. I'll be back. Cervic. I promise. He promised. I love you, Jill. Stop. I 
I know. I love you too. Can't just do this with the theme. <laughs> Clive, you better come back. If he breaks Jill's heart, he's not. He's gonna be my least favorite protagonist. If she did it better than Han Solo. You'd better not break Jill's heart. <laughs> I'd be dancing. My buddies. Now, we have a god to kill. Gadatha. Can we fly in? Wait, don't tell me that all three of them fused. <laughs> oh, Jill. Jill, he promised. <laughs> Jill. It's okay. He promised. Clive's not the kind of guy who breaks his promise. He'll be back. He'll be back. Oh my god. This is so cool. Ah, oh, the prelude. Later Dutch. Origin. We made it. Incredible, this game looks. I'm just seeing Bahamut doing his thing. Look at that wingspan. Oh, he funneled them all in. Damn, that's a big hole. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, Taxi dodge to save that one up. He did dodge a lot of little dudes. Architect. There you are. It was here that we slumbered. Here that we waited. <laughs> Freaking for centuries. Bold underlined T. Clinging to our decrepit shell for fear that we might have need of it once again. 
But you have come at last. <laughs> what is it? Is it in his and ending sentence tease? Complete. Well, there's three of us and one of him. That's right, Clive. Let's make it count. Damn, I love how in sync they all are. <laughs> Dion's not wasting any time. Oh shit. Dominance. We will show you what it means to suffer. Where are we dropping, boys? They do have to ask, they do. Oh, this song. If from Phoenix and Vomit, we're all sharing the same health bar. Is the audio okay right now, by the way? I was... Get him, Clive. Yeah, I'm, I'm blue flame. It's good, okay, thank you. Oh, zero! No, we're get, we're blowing it. Oh, so this is the closest we'll ever get to controlling Dion. Remember that one time. Damn. He is nailing these dodges. Oh fuck. This is this is like painful, like watching all this go down and seeing the health bars. This is so much more effective than it was just a cutscene. Like achieving the health bars is is nuts. It's red versus blue. Move aside, oh my god, second time we get to play as Dion. Fire. Oh my god. <laughs> he should go freaking Bermuda Triangle of icons right now. Look, Elta is like not even phased. Oh! I didn't even... I wasn't even going to predict that. Okay, come on. You're literally getting nuked here. <laughs> Wait, did that... <laughs> For real? <laughs> did I actually get nuked? I was, I was so expecting, like, that to dissipate, and then Ultima's fine. I'll be like, oh man, what is this trouble? I mean, it might still happen. I don't think he's actually thwarted at all. But...
I was expecting it to continue, like, this screen is a surprise. But anyway, let's see how much of a lie that was. Dude, it's so sick, though! <laughs> I like- I, I like everything that's happening right now. This is teamwork. It's all me for not. Yep, he's dead! End of the game, we did it. Yep, it was just, uh, QT boss fights. Yep, game over. <laughs> Yeah, I wasn't expecting to try disaster. I was just watching. I'm like, oh, they're doing their summons or their attacks together. And then I was like, oh, I should have known it was try disaster. See, I know it's going to go south from here for them. For them. Like, Ultima's going to come back and all. But if you shut your PS5 right now, you technically win and can just use your head cannon that you went back to Jill. Be like, well, we saved the day. All right, we're continuing. All right, ready? Let's see it not happen at all. Oh, I'm so shocked. I'm so shocked that he's okay. Oh no, he's teleporting. No, nothing personal, kid. He's- he's doing his own try disaster I guess. Oh, my not- go! Go bother someone else. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no! Not my- not my friends! <laughs> No. Save your brother. Dion better be okay. Damn. Green Goblin Spider-Man moment. But he's not dead. Dion, oh my god, please be okay. It is done. No, not like this. Oh, we would have forgiven you even without that. Yeah, this is the non-canon ending. The canon ending was that Ultima got thwarted and we went home and Dion was okay. No, I'm I'm still I'm still gonna keep my hopes up that Dion walks out of that unscathed. <laughs> Everyone everyone's gonna walk out. Unscathed. No. If anyone's okay, it's Clive, for now. Yeah. Did he actually die-die? He uses Phoenix Downs on him? <laughs> Welcome back.
Did I mention you look terrible? <laughs> that makes two of us. Oh, I'll be all right. And Dion. <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> no, we don't. We don't know, chat. We don't know. He's probably fine. No body, no death, right? Take my hand. No, I told you, I'll be... <coughs> Come on. Thank you. Oh, he's accepting help. <laughs> Where's the odd? Press on. Always. Yeah, 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 yeah. He cast an auto life before the battle. <gasps> the dragon. Oh, you made me up with me and my bro. Stupid game. Stop hurting your favorite boys. I know anyone but Dion. Instead of all this, <laughs> return to the Lucky Sands. What's that? Sorry about Dion. Don't be. Please. He did what he had to do. We don't know. And this time we did the same. It's like 14, you get used to it. It's the talk to auto of 14. Ah, nice. Can't wait. He yeah, he took the chance to elope with Terrors. He he just okay. Dion faked his death uh to live a happy life with Terrors. Should we stop? Because of the cough. Yeah, I think we're past that, Clive. Hey, I had a cough. I suppose we are. I couldn't play Fall Fantasy for a month. And so you made it. Dion's okay, by the way, don't worry. That light, so cold. Clayton, that's so wise. So empty. We're close, aren't we? It, uh, seems that way. But I don't want to think what could be waiting for us in there. Then think instead of those waiting for us at home. Yeah, I'm gonna live forever. <laughs> I should have stopped playing after it said Ultima Prime thwarted. Jesus. <sighs> yeah, this game's so pretty. Ooh, Dracula? I hate what you've done with the place. Oh, the icons? Clive. Oh. Are they all free? <laughs> they... They can't be. But they are. This is the Nexus. A wellspring of life. <laughs> Yours and ours, as we watch the world stumble slowly to its dark end. It was here we pledged a new beginning. And now, with the ether we have harvested, Harvest I shall raise my kin. Are we gonna have to fight each dead or free? That together we may usher in a new age of reason. This was never about creation, only self preservation. You condemned an entire world so that you alone might escape death. Alone. Him alone. Joshua? Life. I think I understand. He... What? But he's, he's not alone? Whoa.
Wait, what were those people? Oh no. They sacrificed their flesh to become beating hearts of crystal that pumped the land's lifeblood from the depths of the earth unto this very chamber. And thus would they labor still, long after their work was done, had you not set them free. You meant for us to destroy the Mother Crystals. We fucked up. It's what you wanted all along. You have Sid. our gratitude, you thought. This was Sid's fault. In this, you have served us well. You have both served what? us well. How are we supposed to know? Welcome home, brother. He's turning to Jill. Valentine. Because he's still got that bullshit in him, right? I thought uh, it was me, but it wasn't my grasp that grew weaker. It was theirs that grew stronger. Shit. Joshua. No. No, he can't be dead. No, everything's fine. Oh, I. S okay, they were all ultimates. We can become one. Oh no, literally. Wait, so this is essentially fighting like seven Ultimas or however many there are? Remember when Clyde was like, oh, 3v1? Well, now it's 1v7. Oops, all Ultimas. Okay, wait, that's, that's, that's. Clive. So Ultima plus two. No, okay. Shh. Oh, oh, he's okay. The one possessed of the destructive flames of Ifrit and the healing flames of the Phoenix. This I once believed would be Ultima's true. Clive, you can't lose Joshua. <laughs> Not for all this. But I was wrong. I see it now. Why you will never become Ultima's vessel. Hold on. Listen to me, Clive. Do you remember the murals? People once knew that Ultima was their god. That he created them. And they worshipped him, prayed to him, looked to him for guidance. In vain. In vain. For he did not listen did not acknowledge our will and so we strayed from his path to forge one of our own so absorbed was he in his own desires so driven by his own will alone that he shunned the one thing that could have made him truly powerful faith the same faith of course. People, it's not faith it's you. love faith that you will fulfill their dream Sid's dream of creating a better world for us. Faith that you will follow in Father's footsteps and save those who need saving most. Faith that you will answer Jill's plea to save yourself. The difference is, Clive, you chose to listen, and that is what has steeled our bonds. Bonds that helped you stand firm when Ultima's pole was at its strongest. <laughs> His power may be absolute, but so is ours, and so will yours be. With my light in your heart, Just not up. even a god might stop us. Joshua! Where's all that blood coming from? <laughs> 
Don't do it, you'll... Enough, Clive. My body is too far gone. If the wound does not take me, the cars will. No. The cops will? <laughs> oh, cursed. No, Clive's crying. I don't want this power if it means losing Joshua. <laughs> so sad. We lost him twice this game. Are you done? Does the final piece fall into place? The incantation primed, but one task remains to empty the vessel. Ultimate, can you give us a second, please? I lost Zion and Joshua. Great, now we don't even have his body. He's just making it worse. We got some sick new wings, though, but at what cost? I'm still here. Oh. With me to the end. Even now, you would deny. Inevitable. I'm gonna snap this dude's neck. <laughs> this ifrit, ifrit, this blue ifrit ass neck. Come on, Clive, just be a bigger ifrit. Be a bigger, redder ifrit, and you'll win. That's what you always have. Oh, he's this form now. And always will. Damn, look at him. On this, my sword, I swear. I swear. To shield the firebird's flame forevermore. Damn. Oh, look at that. I love that it lingered on him a bit. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> no, I'm all alone here. Oh shit. Expect you to blow up then. Oh, my diamond dust uh, is faster now. Oh my god, I'm just getting hit like a billion times. No, I don't have regular potions. I forgot to buy some from 
What's her name? God, can I get the timing down or what? He's got holy. I don't know what it blows up. Come on. blows up so I just gotta get out of there I guess <laughs> or time it but I'm a little distraught right now yeah I run right through me <laughs> Stay like that? Oh, get him, get him, get him! Fuck you. Oh, cutscene. He was like. Countless centuries have I waited for this moment. He was like stalling a bit so that I could get hit, get him. In which I might revel in my creation. Only to find it profaned and so. It must be cleansed. So easily broken. Yeah. But it can be broken. And I shall see it so. For such is my will. He's got an Fight. attack based off him. Oh my god, can I even. Nice try. Yeah. Okay, I thought I might not be able to go through it. He like stalls when he does attacks. Oh, get him! Oh. Fuck. Okay, GG's. I just really want to do that. Fuck! I'm missing the timing. We'll get permafrosted. Wait. Fuck, I don't have the thing. And he gets Antetsukin up. But for now, we can smid stagger? regular dodges for this place. Yeah, see, when he does a big attack and he, like, falters, I could definitely... Oh my god, do I have... Yeah, give me that Zany 5! Hi, and I staggered him. I think I might just do Zentetsuken. Oh! <laughs> Let darkness fall. Oh wait. Where are you? Come on, give me to five. Yeah, because his health's like pretty low already, so I'm like, may as well do it while I can, because it's gonna take me to a different phase soon enough. 
Oh, what's this? Oh, take him down. Woo! With the Giga Flare. That was for Dion. Why? Why? What latent force feeds these flames? I sense more here than mere will. Is this Logos? Have you truly become free? Oh, no, well, freedom. No, I forbid it. You are not a god. You are but flesh and bone. You are not one of us. Look, I'm, I'm doing something even better than killing him. I'm making him, like, second guess his entire being and everything. I created you. All like, he is you. falling apart from within, and that is how you truly defeat a villain. Look, he's getting desperate. Oh, whatever. Do you not know who we are? Once, perhaps. But we are no longer yours. <laughs> yeah, you have to make villains super salty. Our flames are our own, and they burn as one! Woo! We're gonna do the, the fuse, but it's just us. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's our wings? Oh, the wings! Oh my god! We haven't seen these since Bahamut. Damned is the slave who turned the skirt upon his master. Oh, that shot. Oh, how do I play? Oh, we have, uh... Get Brimstone. Pit flare! Ah, oh, look at that health bar melt! <laughs> Did you blow up? Are you okay, dude? Aw, oh, poor baby need a break. Poor villain losing his mind, getting salty, need a little baby break. What are you doing? What is this? Oh my god, it's music. It's light speed again? Oh. Oh yeah, wildfire's that. Oh my gosh, I forgot how fluid wildfire looks. It's so cool with the wings. Look at that. Oh, the wings, man. Look, I'm just like admiring the scenery. We're making this guy even more salty. It's like, you're not even taking this fight serious! I'm sorry about the bitrate compression, by the way. Where are you? Oh, I think that has to be a close attack. Oh. Oh my god, seriously, this on stream right now is probably like a bunch of squares. <laughs> Nothing I can do about it though, I'm sorry. Like that's just a Twitch thing. Fuck! Not a Rolia. Suck! No! What the fuck is that? I love how the camera is like constantly kind of switching like in and out. Can stop for two seconds. No, you're not close enough. Dude, stay in one place. Oh my god, where is he? He can't dodge Spitfire. A <laughs> point blank Spitfire. I I remember Brim's Brimstone has like a. Fire shall fire be repaid. 
Um, it doesn't matter. Are you doing the countdown? Press the attack. Ooh! Yeah, it was, the, it was like close up attacks or some shit. My, I forgot if there, he has any more secret abilities. Hold on. Yeah, it was just like this stuff. Whole square. I can do that too. Thirty. Is that my oh, this way? It's like they timed it perfectly for when the fireball can recharge enough times. Shit. So I definitely feel like my next fireball attack is gonna mostly kill him. Oh, is your little shield breaking? Oh. Oh, what was this? No, it like, it like interrupted. It was like a phase that interrupted it. Oh, you cheater. You fucking cheater. Is it because I was insulting you with the baby talk? He stole my fireballs. Ten. Wait, no, this is not. I don't feel like he's actually counting down correctly. Oh, five, whatever. Staggered. Oh, I should have waited. What am I doing? I see a fireball is my charge up. Oh my god, hurry, fireball charge up before the phase! No, oh, it's too late! We're not fireballs, spit. I don't know why I kept saying fireballs. It's the same spot. If only I could set that off before. Oh, the rapture. I should probably dodge or something. What the fuck? He's using Doritos. You're gonna smite me? Was that a stagger? A half, st a half stagger? Oh, poor baby got staggered. Oh. Poor pathetic wannabe god.
one more precision dodge for the road because I don't know if I can keep getting them. There's just so much happening on my screen. I'm like, I don't know if I'm even close enough for the dodge. Oh, boo Look, see, we're breaking him from within. Step one on defeating a villain get him salty. Step two, destroy his mental state. No. Step three, whatever you no. see fit. No. My will is Hi, Bok. Something is wrong. You're afraid. You always have been. From the moment the Blight exposed what you were, weak, you conceived us to prove otherwise. But the results shook you to the core. For in us you saw yourself, and realized we had the potential to be more than you could ever be. And so you turned your back on your creation. Your back on the world, like the coward you are. You Ooh. You know me. So that's step three, insulting them. Nothing, no Salt gosh. in the wounds. Nothing. Yeah, I'll turn. Oh, you're bringing a new phase for us to. Wait, is it, this is this. We're on step four. Do it again, basically. Reinforce why his mental state. Oh, that's a lot of ultimates. He's holding his head. Yeah, step four is reinstating why. Like, why they're getting a mental breakdown. I know he's so flamboyant. What? I have to fight that? What a REM five, I can do it. I have nothing to lose. <laughs> Everyone wants that drive jail. Ooh, it's a cool helmet. In light, I, stand above you, my rebirth complete. I like the angelic motif you, that he's got going on. Eternity of oh, he looks really cool. Pain, suffering. You it's have rebirth. None of these. But we have. So we know what they grant. They bring us together. And that makes us strong. No, I'm I'm Done Clive more. again. Fullman and Fulgor. Wait, there's hazards everywhere. I thought maybe. I was doing all of the summons. Oh no! Oh, that would have been great to do the arm, Army of Darkness, whatever it's called. Gonna do it. Do look at the health bar barely going down with this. I know it's because of this, but. I think you can start do doing Odin stuff, because I'm not ready for me to start doing Odin stuff. Odin's mine! You can't have him. That is so much stagger even on him.
Hurry. Fuck. Oh, cutscene. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. We haven't seen Garud in a while. Oh my god, this would be the- Are these my friends? My friends are here. Oh my god, are we gonna hear everyone? Or Sid? Are we gonna hear- Are we gonna hear Sid? Dude, I love this mirror match. <laughs> See, look. Oh, Titan! <laughs> ah. Mitch, Th this is part of the step four. Remind him that he's a lonely loser and we have the power of friendship and teamwork on our side. That gets villains all the time. He's like, what are these voices I'm hearing? That's that. Ultim What's your name? Altimolius? That's the power of my friends. Here, run into me! Shit. Go, go, quick. This is music. Ultimali, I know. <laughs> when I said Ultimali, I was like, oh, I said Tamali for sure. Little Tamali. Oh, little baby said Tamali. Oh, shit, where'd he go? Is he over there? I mean, he's getting his health bar. Is going down? Oh! Oh, where are you? It doesn't do much regular, uh, much regular damage. Here, let's get Zen Tetsuken up again. Go, go! Go, go! Yes! <laughs> we are so ready next time! Ready for a Zanny 5 round 2. Almost. I just keep mashing it. Oh. Cutscene said, I don't think so. Cutscene said, I'm not alone! He's gonna do a Kamehameha. But we have... Dying. The power of teamwork and friendship. That's my boy. <laughs> Byron, what are you doing here? <laughs> I was like, he's gonna be a cool D online. It's straight up just Byron. Dion's gone, but you know, That's so is Sid. <gasps> Together. Oh, Jill. Darkness unending. Oh, no, he's. Are they going to Zanny five each other? Oh my god. Yo! I love that pose! Oh, <gasps> Dad! Ah! Cut him down! Oh. Oh. No. Mine is oh. the ultimate which oh, did you your sword pray? break? Mine are break. I can do that too. Oh, he lost his helmet. Still you cannot see. You are no better than us. I can do that too. Look, I don't even need to do this. I already have Sandy Five.
How's music right now? Get him, get him, get him! Ooh, shit. Well, we're getting tossed around. On diamond dust stuff. Oh, this wasn't close enough. I guess he's up. Kind of, oh, because he's leaving. You dick. Made me waste my diamond dust. Should we? I don't mean to do that. Dude, I'm trying to dodge you. Whatever, let's do the 85. We get another one. Can always get another one. By the time he's fully stunned, I get Giga Flare back too. I'm gonna use my strength tonic. Shit. Forgot it's not cheesed. See, that's when we do the dancing seal. Oh shit, I'm too far. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. It's okay. I swear I thought I was closer until I was actually there. Uh, what was that? Tells me I might not make it through this. Oh, that's it? I'm starting to hate this and that. I'm trying to do the other attack, like my base one. Guess what? My, where is he? No, I need a spear. Oh, he went up. I thought we gonna slow it down a bit more. Have the music. I don't have dancing steel. Shit. He's gone. He left. I've like wasted all of my diamond dust in his face. No, stop. I don't have any more healing after this. Fucking come on. Every time I do any move, he leaves. See, that is when we want to do it, but I thought I was going to leave and fuck off already. Shit. 
shit. I'm just kind of spamming in case I can catch him, but in the catch him in the act, but I I keep mistiming it and he just leaves so that I'm over here looking like a fool. I, mean, I guess that's pretty bad if you don't dodge it, but Yeah, cutscene! He left into the cutscene. That was kind of close. I had, like, no healing. He has such little health left, I imagine this is the final bit. No, he was safe from the cutscene, because <laughs> I could have still taken him. I had Zanny 5 and ready, almost ready to go. I was in Zanny 2, but you know. Forevermore, he says. Yeah, you meant him. Yeah, good. Because you're losing. So sure of your place atop the world, you refuse to acknowledge those below. You chose to remain alone, and so you shunned the one thing that could have made you stronger. Pushed away the hands that could have raised you higher. <laughs> What's that, Clive? I do not need you. You are anyone, and that is where we are different. I could not have made it here on my own. I carry with me the hopes and dreams of my brothers, my sisters. And it is they who will give me the strength to end your reign. Do there's more? Look, we're gonna Zanny five him. Oh, you're the end? I mean you're gonna die so you're kind of right here I want to I wanted uh, is this like our opportunity to spam all of our moves at on him because that's kind of sick if so look at that stun look he doesn't know what to do look he's getting oh didn't get it with the Zanny 5, but that's okay. That's for Dion! For real this time! That's what they all say. That's a <laughs> mortals. The only fantasy here is yours. And we shall be its final witness. Okay. Relax. <laughs> I said. I said this is Final Over. Fantasy. Yeah. And now this is for Joshua. <laughs> Clive himself did a whole squad of nines. Did you see that? That wasn't a freight. That was like what? It's a five digit nines? Six? What was it? A six? Or was it actually max? Because it was like it was like uh, doing the blur effect. I wasn't sure if it was meant to be that much or if it was like four digits and just blurring. Either way, that was Clive. You were here. Why didn't you do that first? Because. He had to let it build up. He had to have- he had to say a cool- it was the cool line. It was the Final Fantasy line that fueled him. It wasn't just the punch. It was what the- what was behind the punch. Tell me, what 
What do you imagine will befall this world now that you have gained your precious freedom? I honestly don't know. Be with but I Jill. Think it will be pretty. A sorry tale of sin and suffering, hardship and pain. You saw so, he's so splayed out. He looks like a cockroach or something. It's like, oh no, I'm dead. It's who we are. We fight. We survive. We endure. We don't need a reason. We are imperfect creatures. Clive, not you. You are perfect. For a shoulder to lean on. When we fall, we stand back up. A prelude. We see the horizon, ever out of reach, and still we march on. Certain the answers lie just beyond it. Because that is our way. My congratulations. Oh! Relish this victory, knowing that you have but delayed the inevitable that can't a compliment like that means we successfully broke in his mental state we won yeah yeah well talking shit's literally all he has left we definitely broke this man he said he, he lost said gg I don't want to say GG. Whatever, I wasn't even trying. Yeah. He didn't mean it, though. He was so trying. I went through, what, four f phases of that fight? Of that asshole? Mad cause bad. GG dead game. <laughs> Oh no. Uh, I, I can't. Please be okay. Five, do something, please. <laughs> At least he gets time to grieve now. I was kind of worried he never would. Josh, if only you could have seen what we did. It was so cool. He, like, flew around. No, I can't. <laughs> Stop it! No, they were little babies. No. <laughs> this is going to be a scene we haven't seen. Uh, why are they doing this to me? Oh, Platinum, I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> oh my god, Dad- Oh, Mom's ruining it, but Dad's here. Oh, is this when he becomes a shield, like, officially or something? <laughs> Byron's here. Gonna set his hair on fire. Aww. 
There's a baby. Oh, we're going even further back. Why? Was it our first meeting ever? I like how he's kept the same hair for so long. Oh my god, no, stop, don't do this to me. Clive may have done how much damage salt smell with that punch, but these fucking cutscenes are doing way more. <laughs> Save him! Oh my god, bring him back. Do it. Whatever you're doing. Whatever you're doing, do it well. Wait, he's okay? What, so is- oh, wait, 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 Why is he all clean now? He like zapped the shit out of him. Do it, Clive, I'll kill you. Oh. It seems Ultima's power was too great for this vessel all along. <sighs> what are you having? Perhaps I can use it to set things right. And see Ultima's legacy. Bearers. Dominance. Crystals. Magic. Consigned to the flames. Even if it means the end of me. Have you promised? You know what? Joshua and Dion didn't promise Jill they'd be back. Maybe that's the problem. Have you promised Jill? The secret to living in this game is promising Jilly will be back. Right, Clive? Don't make me look like a liar. Is everyone watching? Had I mean, they could see it from the hideaway. Do you think they're all just like watching in anticipation? Well, I mean, I know Jill is. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> like a bonfire? Oh, I can't cry anymore. You know damn well Jill's waiting. Oh. The credits is that look at all those voice actors oh ben star first bill god what an amazing performance <laughs> young clive ben star yeah he's great he makes me love clive look he's okay that sand Knocked out of the park for real. Like all, like he he like yells and cries a lot in this game. So it's like those voice cracks sound so genuine. Oh no no, he's doing the thing. 
five. No, you promised Jill. She's gonna see it too. He promised. Stop doing this to me. I said I don't want to cry anymore. Oh my god, she finally ever baby. It's been a month. What you gonna call Jill? Let me see, let me see. Oh, read little one. Got a smile for your uncle Gov. Not so loud, you bird. What? I was only shh. You're scaring him. It's all right. She sees the moon. Uh, <laughs> oh, was... Don't look at the no, hotel. <laughs> Are they gonna cut to Torgal crying too? Oh, Torgal just staring. Oh my god. If you need a rest, I can Five. take it. He's a liar. The world's yours now. Yours to do with as you please. That's what Sid wanted. That's what they both wanted. <laughs> That's like what he said to him. This was voiced by somebody named Harry Lloyd. That's both Dumb and Dumber characters. Ultima's voiced by Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> That's kind of awesome. I wish I was named Harry Lloyd. I'm sorry for ruining it, but Harry Lloyd, like, come on. Yeah, I know it's said from Xenoblade. I just didn't know that was his name. Just he promised. And thus did our journey end. Samson, I, I was way off. <laughs> We'd start with the nest, though. Just love Dumb and Dumber. I think he's older than Dumb and Dumber. Susie, Susie, help. This is a DMCA song. Fuck it. Look, combat director Ryota Suzuki. My, my guy. DMCA mutes this one. All right, well, I guess I'll, I'll mute it too. Sorry, I wouldn't, I don't want to mute it, but I mean, I could just appeal it, but I guess if it's on YouTube. Oh, Dia Hunt. You know what? I th I was a lot happier during the month where I did- Hi, Barnabas. I, I was a lot happier the month where I didn't play this game. So I, uh... Where I did enough to suffer through this ending. Or Clive D. and Joshua. So, even everyone else who's still alive, too, is all sad now. 
I know I was safe and happy. Instead of, you know, I think COVID was trying to save me from this ending. They're like, COVID's like, no, you don't want to beat FF16. Trust me, I got you. And COVID's like, what's up? This is the longest credits. Big chance for DMCA. They were doing me a favor. Best for the credits if you want as well. Oh, I see. Yeah, I, I don't mind. If this song's gonna DMCA me, I'd rather talk about the game when the song's not playing. I mean, I could just talk over it. Look, I'm sorry. Look, all these really talented and skilled and wonderful human beings working on this amazing game of the year game. I'm sorry I'm skipping over it, but the song is... The song is dangerous for my channel, apparently. I want to melt to your bed after this. Beats, can we watch 90 Day Fiance? We're the show where... It, that doesn't make me cry. I'm just saying, like, festival, right? Yeah, thank you for letting me know. This is amazing. No, the song's great. I shouldn't cry at school with your stifling cry, but it's pretty funny. <laughs> just be really exaggerated. I a puppy in a cup. That's how I feel right now. Everything's gonna be okay. Oh, please, Clive, are you okay? <laughs> what? What? What could this possibly be? Is this gonna make me feel any better? Who are these? Who, who are you? Oh, unmute. I'm sorry. Thank you for reminding me. Oh. 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 Every time. Will you light it? Yes, mother. Who are these people? Oh, it's showing that... Wait! Come I'm like... If only I had the flames when are I they like it. legends now? Icon? Have you been reading <gasps> they the are. same story again? <laughs> Yeah, this is like Magic belongs much in after. Fairy tales, and fairy tales don't boil kettles. No, it was real. Clive sacrificed himself well for done. you. <laughs> All of them did. Now be a good lad and play with your brother until. It's not a fairy tale. You Come bitch. On. Hurry, hurry. Oh, right. The Torgal's ancestor. I bet you he's still gonna like. Maybe, maybe magic's not gone. Hold on, I'm still. <laughs> I'm kind of, I'm concerned that magic is going to come out of nowhere, but I really hope it doesn't, because I, I wouldn't want... Right, let's play the saint in the sector. No, I don't want to be magic. Sounds like Joshua. What do you want to play then? What are the... Oh! Joshua's! We're out of luck on Final Fantasy. Hi, I'm the older brother. Sorry, that was really silly. I like that he wrote it. Perhaps Bahamut says so. His name's Bahamut? Wait, is Joshua okay then? Why did he write it? He published the Final Fantasy. He did it. Dude. Tricking a little dog named Bahamut is so funny. What, you telling me New Game Plus? <laughs> Look at these saves. <laughs> July 1st. It is now July 31st. I should have saved before I did all that. Demo complete. Well, I'm not... I'm not saving over that. I just wanted to look at the dates because it's like... I'm not going to time travel. And we're back. New Game Plus. Gameplay mode Final Fantasy also now available to exclusive to New Game Plus. That's cool. Is everyone alive in it? Game is over. Hear the tragedy of Clive Rosfield? I thought not. Not a legend of Jedi would tell you. He created THE Final Fantasy. 
That's so cool. I liked all the little references there. Uh, the, the quote where he's like, oh, something, something, this is a fantasy and take your final step or some shit. That, that was funny. It was a bit much, though. It felt like they were like, oh, fuck, how do we put fantasy and final in the same sentence? <laughs> but it was funny. Shedding tears. My face is falling apart. I know. Bedstar is amazing. You should be in everything. I made it. So the title is more tactful than Rick and Walking Dead. <laughs> a lot more tactful, but yeah, I was like, okay, here we go. Yeah, it's, um, I, I'd, I'd say, I mean, it, they did what they wanted to do. Like, it's, it's, it's a good ending. Like, quality-wise, it's a good ending, but, like, it's a happy ending for, like, the world they live in, obviously. It's just sad for us, because... Who gives a shit about those new people except for little, little doggy Bahamut? I don't care about them, I care about our friends. Yeah, happy. Happy for the greater good, not happy for us. <laughs> Name your next dog Bahamut? Do it. Name my next dog. I don't know. Also about it. My head can't everyone live. My head can in Ultima was thwarted. And they went back and lived their life. Joshua still wrote his book. Basically everything in the post credits happened, but no one died. Should turn on the PS5. If only I knew. Getting COVID was my first warning. Ultima thwarted was my second warning. Yeah, you counter all the icons. I really love stuff like that. I really like... I, so I, I like challenging boss fights, or like ch challenging final boss fights as much as the next person. But I also really like when there's kind of like a victory lap type of final boss as well. Maybe like after the challenging fight. Where the whole point of it is just to be cool. But every boss in this game, the whole point of it is to be cool. But the moment with Ultima was definitely that last phase where you just counter all the icons. It's like he brought out Gerita. I'm like, I know that. I haven't seen it in a while because I stopped using Gerita sort of early on, but I know that. Oh my god, Pompla Goose, thank you for the Prime sub 28 minutes ago. I'm sorry I missed it. Game Dude, you don't... Uh, Set 200 bits sporadically. Thank you so much. I had alerts off because I don't want uh, the sound effects going over anyone's voice or anything, but thank you. Is also this plan doomed no matter what? Possibly. I mean, I think... I think it was, though, regardless of Leviathan. Yeah, Bahamut was my favorite. Bahamut and Titan... I really like the Barnabas fights, though, because... Yeah, the Barnabas fights were great. I just also wish you would fight Odin as well. Like, find a way. Because, like, he shows up in the fight, but you don't really fight Odin the way you do Titan and Bahamut. But, yeah, which is really unfortunate, but the Barnabas fights were cool. It's very... They're very, like, Virgil one-on-ones. 16-2. We get Leviathan DLC and Clive actually gets the icon powers, new ending. New, yeah, maybe we like spawns off a new timeline or something. Where like the same thing happens and they like still defeat Ultima and save the world with no magic and all that, but Clive doesn't die. <laughs> or everyone else. They use too much budget for Bahamut. I don't know. I mean, they may have had to delegate and shafted some other fights, but I don't know. I mean, that was a really great fight. Boris is the best fight for Ptosayan. The falls in the ocean awakens. Stop it with then. No, Dion falls and is fine, and he's still Bahamut. Bye, yeah, thank you for watching till the end. We did it. We got here together. I think it was originally going to be the boss for the ship stage. Yeah, I could see that. 
They do reference the I, I do kind of like that they referred him as a lost I, I don't, uh, icon. I think having that aspect was interesting. Like, it does suck and I would have liked to see Leviathan, but if any of them had to be lost, I'm happy it was him because I, I feel Final Fantasy XV, for example, had such a big Leviathan uh, set piece, basically. Um, that, so I feel like we didn't need to see a Leviathan moment. So I, I'm if, if any if any summon got cut, it's fine that it was him. But and then and then repurposing him as like a lost icon for lore purposes, that was that's cool. That's a cool way to like not completely cut him. The popular theory that a little girl who ups Deanna is Leviathan dominant. See, I was jokingly saying that because she kept popping up everywhere, so I'm like, she has to be an important character. Is she Leviathan? I'm cool I'm, that makes me happy that it's a theory. If Leviathan finds him, oh maybe. May have been like 20 crystals around the world, a bunch of icons. Maybe there's more. Yeah, I'm down to see whatever they're gonna do for DLC. I feel like the possibilities are I mean, I wouldn't say the possibilities are endless, but I feel like this game's lore is pretty dense uh with the opportunity to do like a bunch of different things. Like Leviathan itself is like that that's like DLC bait right there. Did I cry? Did I cry? Yeah, Tor was Fenrir. Oh, thank you for joining. Strife, I finally did it. Lots of crying. See this game world we didn't see. Yeah, there's a lot. See now, like I love this world so much. I wouldn't like how did Final Fantasy 13 get three games? I mean I know why, because they love lighting and stuff, but how sad would it be that 13 has three games and 16 might not? Which I know not everything needs sequels and and it has to be its own sub franchise, but I would I wouldn't mind a 16 too. I don't know what they would do, but yeah, the way the universe is set up is great. You think it'll get a lot of spin-offs? Give us more, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with one game too. I, I think I think that this game's beginning to end is totally great as like a standalone thing, but I loved it so much and seeing more of it would make me happy. <sighs> Said game, maybe. Even if it's... I mean, I don't know. They, they did say they're open to DLC, right? So I don't think it's actually gonna be over. Well, it's magicless to us now, but you know, there's all there's always opportunity for storytelling. Ultima comes back, whatever. They could do anything. In a franchise like Final Fantasy where magic is around any corner, they can literally do whatever they want. Just because magic is gone now. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad, Strive. Have a good night. It'd just be like FF6, like the second half of it. Ultima's gone, God, I'd feel. You hear the way you hear the way he was shit talking. That guy is salty. <laughs> He's gonna find whatever whatever reason he can to come back. He's like, and he's gonna come back. He's gonna work so hard to come back. However, he's gonna do it. Find out that Clive is dead. And just feel like he's wandering aimlessly because he's just like, I, I don't have anyone to to enact my revenge on. I have no one. Now I just, I will wander these lands. <laughs> I'm still a long period between ending and the post credits where magic is fading. They said it wouldn't fade immediately. Uh, ultimate the farmer. He has to hide his other arms. The only item ultimate drops after beating was a giant bag of salt. <laughs> uh, I've never... 
Dude, this is the salt on that guy was so funny. It was really familiar. I was playing Dead by Daylight last night, so I felt all that salt was really familiar. I was like, I've been there. I get it. Didn't even leave with the GGs. Just a backhanded compliment. I'm sad that Clive survived. I definitely think he he died. But even still, I don't know how far ahead that post credits was in the future. But you know, everyone gets old. <laughs> so, it's like they would die anyway. So salty. FF7s and her six turns. I don't think either of them are. I'm sad. Thanks, Clive, Josh, and Deer are dead. I'm pretty sure they're dead, but I also... I, my new headcanon is that they are fine. Because it doesn't matter. <laughs> the future, yeah, right, 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 that's the thing. The future thinks magic is... There, there's fairy tales. There's lots of stuff pointing to Clive living when you start looking into it. Oh, really? Well, yeah, I don't know when Cly or when Joshua finished that book. Like, did did Clive actually save him, or did he just finish it? Like previously, with uh, like how he wanted things to go, you know, p pot potentially gave it to Jill and was just like, "Can you please publish my book?" <laughs> If I don't make it out of there, like, I don't know. Yeah, Yotsi could have done it. But it also could just, like, like, you guys, come on, like, jo there, there is idea to believe that Joshua made it. But either the, either the book was unfinished and somebody else ended it with like the way they wanted it to end, you know, or they're just telling it like, okay, Josh, everyone's dead. Let me finish his book. Like Yote could have finished it. Oh, Clive making a book. But I can see Yote finishing it. I can see Yote finishing it. I mean, they were close enough. <laughs> ben Starr has been tweeting, so I assume Clive lived. But yeah, so like that's a possibility. Um, just because the book is done doesn't mean Joshua lived. Like, that's not a hundred percent evidence that he lived. Other- other people can take over and finish a book if the original author's gone, you know? Just saying, it's not conclusive evidence. As much as I want that to be the truth, like, I would love for Joshua to be alive. No, but we're, we're Joshua. Joshua didn't write. We're, the possibility is that Joshua may have not wrote it. Like he died, and then, however, like we don't know how the book ends. Like we didn't read the book. We don't know how it ends. We don't know if the ending is in Joshua's, like actually what happened to them, or if somebody just made it up, like what they thought happened. Be like, yo, know, listen, everyone. Every, they killed Ultima and returned back home safely, and the magic is gone. The end. <laughs> Let us read the book square. I mean, I imagine the game was based on the book. Like, in that universe, obviously not in real life. Fall by 16 was not based on <laughs> Joshua's book. What if it never happened? It was just a book this whole time? No, don't say that. Their new son, Joshua. DLC would be the book and it's completely different. Yeah, like a more fairy tale esque like idea. Oh, yeah, book is actually the first Final Fantasy. It's full circle. Clive's hideaway symbol. So Clive says pack really stabbed a crystal. Gotcha. Side quest mentions writing a book. Wait, any? Wait, what side quest? Quite a story which really contextualizes the ending once you remember that one line.
Wait, what? This is a story we experience is an embellished version based off the universe book and the whole- Oh my god, yeah, you're reminding me of, like, Resident Evil Dark Side Chronicles? Where, like, the Code Veronica part is just, like, way over the top because that's the- that's the story Leon's retelling to Chris. Based on what Claire told him once. It's like, yeah, and they were, like, swinging on shit, it was so sick, bro. <laughs> yeah, Leon's version of the story. <laughs> Tell me everything. The last Harpo quest? Oh, you're referencing that quest, okay. <laughs> Kept adding stuff that never happened. The quill mentions Cloud saying him the pen writing a story and Cloud's like, maybe I was something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so you're saying because of that you think Clive lives and finished Josh's story? I can see... But like, Clive looked like he was being petrified because of the ma the magic or whatever. I know that's not really supposed to happen to him, but like... It did. Only his hand, really. Well, doesn't it just- doesn't it start at the hand? Doesn't it go over your entire body? I mean, may yeah, you're, you're right. Maybe it was just like a slow process and then he was able to make it back in time. But I don't know, I feel like that ending really wants you to think that he died. I feel like it'd be kind of weird to show all that and be like, no, he lived. You can see it progressing in that scene. Right, like, why would they focus on the fact that his body's petrifying just to be like, oh, he's fine. It definitely wants you to think he wrote the book. Yeah, and I'm not- I'm saying I don't think it is because... I feel like... I feel like whoever, whoever finished the book is obviously doing it in spirit of, like, Clive and Joshua's journey. That's why- it, there's like- there's a reason that it's not, you know, oh, story by Yoti, because it's Joshua's story, she just wanted to finish it. Just as her as an example. Yeah, I... Feel like you could go both ways. I'm in the boat that Clive is dead, and that so is Joshua. To me, I don't know. To me, that ending makes sense, but I, I, I can see. Yeah, even Gav could have ended it because yeah, that's true. It's just true. He got his room. <laughs> but I mean, I I can understand everyone's point of view why you think Clive might be alive and stuff, but. I don't know, to me that ending... I'm not negative, I'm just basing my opinion based on what I saw. Started writing the book during the five-year time skip. Started? Wasn't it Joshua's book? Joshua's book was published IRL. It was, it's called Final Fantasy in 1980-something. <laughs> She said everyone's been on Reddit for three weeks while you didn't finish. So the theory's already hardened in. Ah, that's true, that's true. Yeah, I just finished the game. I haven't had time, obviously, I haven't had time to think about it and rewatch stuff and settle, really. But based on my immediate reaction, I believe what we saw is, in fact, what, we ha what happened. Someone book cover Sid symbol. Yeah, it's fine. Somebody from the hideout. Could have finished it, like, Gav, even. See the light eventually? My light is that they sacrificed themselves for the greater good. They did what they wanted to do. Or Otto. There we go. That's the real writer, Otto. We should have known. It was Otto. Otto finished the book. Torgal. <laughs> Tor oh, I see a paw print. No, oh, fuck Vivian. She probably goes on and on. Vivian also hint that he died, but apparently Japanese lyrics hint he survived. Oh no, not the different language or uh, translations. It was an autobiography. 
Yeah, Sarah is a good point. They didn't kill the dog. We got a new one even at the end. Why would they not just show Clive turning entirely to stone if they wanted to be dead? Because they wanted to do some artsy thing. Like just seeing seeing Clive's body starting to petrify is enough to be like, oh, he's gonna die. He likes being open to interpretation. Yeah, that's cool. I'm glad that people are seemingly talking about it. That's what it's all about. Getting into the conversation. You can't just halt it by cutting it off. <laughs> Imagine. They were yeah, they were yeah, right? Like if Torgal came with us, maybe it'd be clear that Clive would live, but Torgal's staying back, be like, we're not gonna kill Torgal, so GG's Clive. People pray the star for their loved ones to return, but it goes out on Jill. Oh, the... I didn't realize that's what that was. Like, yeah, the red thing in the sky. I, mean, I want him to live, but I, I don't know. I just, based on what I saw, I feel like they all definitely... left... Gavin Jill's reaction strongly suggests me that Clive was gone. And like even Torgal howling, like, I don't know. It's to me it's very clear, but I don't it doesn't matter. That's cool that we can talk about it. And I love this game. And I love I actually I really did like the ending. I'm definitely gonna play uh do the new game plus thing at some point in Final Fantasy. Maybe not right now. I mean, not right now. But I'll come back to it because I love this game. <laughs> I don't want to stop. My favorite Dion, least favorite. I don't know, some jobber. I know, I'm surprised I didn't get spoiled either. Like, genuinely surprised. Flabbergasting and spoiled. Same. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I wasn't really. I, I hardly spent time on the internet, and everybody in the Discord, there's a Final Fantasy 16 channel that I just completely stayed away from. I don't know where I'd rank this, but I'd put in like top five, maybe. But Clive was dead after sitting on it. Evidence to the contrary is kind of a lot. Well, maybe, maybe I'll change my mind too. We'll see. Near the end on FF mode, and then I'll have the platinum and it'll be over. Just get the Men, men in Black device, purge your memory of it, and play it again. Do you like really unhelpful advice, Saravik? Annabelle's the worst. <laughs> unhelpful advice is the best. Well, sh Annabelle's on the first for some people. I'm sure she's on the hot to crazy scale. But I don't think she's hot, even. She's a bitch, and that bitchiness seeps through her exterior. God, this whole game's soundtrack to me is like, this is one of the best songs I've ever heard. <laughs> like, so many songs. Racists are hot. Yeah, I mean, I don't think she's hot. But she's definitely crazy. Yeah, John, probably. 199 songs, jeez. Yeah, nothing in this game got spoiled for me. Like, even after the break. It's in the soundtrack ever since it came out. I gotta listen to it again. I just wanna listen to the Afraid and Phoenix fight again. Oh my god, like, I'm just thinking back to the beginning parts of this game. Just hearing that fight, or that song during that fight. It never got old, and then seeing it again, uh, or hearing it again, so I'm, my, I'm scatterbrained, hearing it again during the Bahamut fight. Uh, I think you did, Cervic, yeah. Legally, yep. 
Could you be at spoil? No, legit. Like I was so busy, like doing the whole moving and being sick thing. Like I mean, and I also Twitter doesn't matter anymore. So like I've have not been compelled to check Twitter almost at all lately, which has been really nice. So I didn't get any Twitter spoilers. I don't really go on YouTube, so I don't get YouTube thumbnail spoilers. <laughs> I avoided everybody in Discord is really nice with no, I don't mean X, okay? <laughs> I'm calling it Twitter. But everyone in Discord is really nice and respectful with like spoiler tagging stuff and then also just sticking to the FF16 channel. So yeah, I just didn't get spoiled. You see how easy it is to avoid spoilers? <laughs> People keep saying just like, oh a YouTube thumbnail spoiled me. I'm like, that really sucks, and I'm sorry that happened to you, but that's literally never happened to me. Like, especially not through YouTube thumbnails. I've been spoiled on Twitter before, but like I like I said, I've just never been on Twitter. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> I'm only calling it Twitter, I don't care. Y'all can pry Twitter from my cold, dead hands. It's on Pinterest, though. Well, I guess I don't really go on Pinterest either, so I lucked out. Oh, it's time with the wrestling. I've been looking for songs. Do you like? Do you get spoiled and you're recommended? I'm really unhinged. If anyone was spoiled, be in Discord. I'd have set them up a flame. <laughs> he would have. YouTube thumbnail was the only way I've ever been spoiled. Yeah, I don't know. I've never seen that. That sucks. Yeah, I can't believe people do that. Putting straight up final bosses on thumbnails, pointing arrows at them. Mr. Fantastic in thumbnail. Ugh, scumbags. Generic ass thumbnail for one of your videos and got complaints of peeing. They got spoiled. <laughs> People are so, like, triggered about getting spoiled or, like, paranoid about it. They're just gonna look a little bit too deeply about a thumb, like, a totally innocent thumbnail. Be like, how is this spoiling me? I'm gonna figure it out and yell at you. What? Xanareth Aesthetics? I don't know who that is. Yeah, the shocked faces. <laughs> and then... Final boss! Final boss, right there! Anyway, I'm sorry for anyone who did get spoiled, though. That It's pretty annoying. One day that's gonna happen to me through YouTube, but it hasn't yet. <laughs> the only time I've ever actually gotten spoiled though is literally just like checking Twitter. And like I'll look I'll link I'll click on a reply or something just to see what people are talking about. And then it's just I see people casually talking about it. My eye glances at something that I don't want to read, but then like my brain sticks with reading it, and I'm like, oh man, I know what that's referencing. Oh, pretty big spoilers in Clive's name. Clive minus the C. Clive lives. Wake up. <laughs> Wake up, sheeple. <laughs> Picture of Dante original Nero Nero's DT. So I have a real quick process of what it was, but yeah. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I didn't get it spelled any of that. I avoided DMC5 trailers, like uh launch trailers. Actually, I watched a little bit of one and it did show a bit of Virgil, right? And I'm like, this launch trailer sucks. Like, why would they show one of the... Like, the biggest moment of that game? One of a few. Yeah, people spoiled the tier reveal in God of War for me as well, but I kind of didn't care. Because I always- I was already suspicious of that. So when I saw it in chat, I'm like, oh, guess I was right. Now I can pay attention to him. Five tricks to beat the final boss with the picture. <laughs> That's so annoying. Like, they keep just come out. It came out. What is wrong with you people? Anyway, my advice to you is... Uh, if- if there's a game- If- if there's a game you want coming out within the week, just don't be on YouTube. Or just, like, cover parts of your screen where you can only see the search bar. Like, if you want to look up something very specific, like uh, Red Letter Media, for example. <laughs> Be a psychopath, cover your fucking screen until you go. 
<laughs> so you see that search bar only. Type in what you need to type in. Hit enter. Bam. Butcher Red Letter Media. No more FF16 spoilers. Autofills a spoiler. <laughs> type type in R. And then real Final Fantasy ND Clive dies is autofill. I'm like, no. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's not that bad. Watch a video stuff I used to recommend is like sports. Stuff. Yeah, that's a, that's the same with me too. I don't watch game stuff on YouTube all that often either, so I have like no game recommendations. I have a lot of movie stuff because I watch other media. There you go. Stop watching game stuff on YouTube. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't matter. Moral of the story is Final Fantasy XVI is great, and I can't wait to play this difficulty at some point. I don't feel comfortable talking about what I'm gonna play next because I just want to think of sixteen some more. Did he really die? I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for joining me on this journey. I'm so sorry I had to take like a month break, but I just, it was out of my power between moving and being sick and then waiting to find the right time to beat it. Cause I'm on like other people's schedules right now. It's been a blast. Thank you. No, the dog and cat stuff's on Instagram. My entire Instagram feed is just animals. <laughs> I yeah, Ben Star should get best performance in whatever kind of game awards are happening this year. Tarak is gonna be my next marathon, but I'm gonna probably play some some other stuff in between. I can't just go from this game immediately to Tarak, you know. Like I need a I need a day or two, so I'm gonna play something something random tomorrow. The strategy of dedicating your social media platform for a different topic it works. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, Ben Star is amazing. It, I love hearing Ben Star talk about how much this game means to him in interviews and stuff. Because you can tell he's like he's mentioned that he's a Final Fantasy fan, but you can really tell he is too. He's not playing it up. He's not just like trying to be one of the pals. Like no, like that dude is a serious, serious fan of video games, just like us. And like that's so sick that he got to be in a franchise he loves. I'm so happy for him. And he's, he did great. I really hope his career blows up now and he could just be in a lot more games and whatever else he wants to be in. Oh, one of us. One of us. Yeah. Yeah, like, that's the thing. Yeah, he gets super nerdy about it. Like, he's, he says things that, like, I don't always hear in more broad interviews because like he is talking from the experience of a gamer so it's like stuff that some like we would say if we ever got cast in a final fantasy just like the little things you know like that you could just pick up on yeah, he likes eight the most i saw there's remasters Talk about Clive because man knows Clive better than any of the players ever could. Right? Yeah. Yeah, thank God. Somebody who knows video games are beeps and bops. <laughs> but aside from Clive, like, everyone did really good. Like, Jill. Jill's performances were great. Yeah, I don't know. I, I really like this whole cast, too. I think the main cast is great. I wish, I wish you could play as them, but that might... See, I'll even take that as DLC, to be honest. It doesn't even have to be story DLC. Imagine like, them just doing like like a DMC5 special edition type thing where you could just play like in the cutscenes and stuff. It's still Clive, obviously, but in in gameplay, it's just like you just play as Dion. <laughs> Ben's there on the ending. Yeah, I wonder. I wonder if he's gonna do like a spoiler interview at some point. Maybe in like a year, because I think doing it now is too soon. They'll have to wait till a bunch of people beat it first. Voice lines of memes since the game came out. I love how much they all love being part of this game. Yeah, all the Barbie stuff. Want to know the name? Devil May Clive. Please Gav when he scouts. Just that one part. Gav separate ways. <laughs> Team makes another FF on an actual party system instead of icon stands. You top party abilities. Yeah, well, the next game definitely won't. I mean, they. All Final Fantasies are different. The next game is not going to do it the same way this did, but 
Yeah, I wonder where they're gonna go from here. I wonder if they're just gonna get the same team to make the next one. Anyway, talking about the next one's too far in advance, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Devil May Auto! Gav Stealth Missions! It's a random door, or a fallen door that Clive comments on but never opens. <gasps> Is it Gav's door? Make the other ones playable? Right, right, right. Oh, this game is so great. Thank you. Yeah, thank you for joining me. I will say my goodbyes, though, so I can rest. Think about the game a bit more. Cry that it's over. Cry, cry again. Am I crying? <laughs> I will see you tomorrow. Whatever I play. It's a mystery to me, too. I don't know. Whatever I feel like playing, because I'm still... I. I I played this game for like a week, or maybe not a week straight, or maybe a week straight, I don't know. It was a week straight, and then I took a month break, and now I'm here. And I'm like, okay, because of that break, I'm not going to get post-game depression, surely. But no, I'm, I still have it. Because I still, even though it was like a break, I, I feel just as strongly about those characters that I did a month ago. So, yeah. <gasps> I can't sleep. I need to decompress with some de Dead by Daylight. <laughs> I need to be in the exact same state um, Ultima was in before he lost. <laughs> Max, salt. <laughs> I need to relate with the villain before I go to bed. <laughs> yep. Alright. Well, GG's, everyone. I'm sure we will be talking about this game for quite some time. And I can't wait to replay it. But until then...